Cody here um, with the result video. This is just another example of the homo, uh, the homophonic and the polyphonic writing style. You could see, um, I'm going to play this back, and you can hear how the first part is homophonic, meaning static harmony following a melody line in the soprano, um, followed by the polyphonic line, which is more scattered, although it does have harmonic tones all throughout, and some passing tones. That's what you'll see in the polyphonic version. So if you're doing a piano piece, note it doesn't have to look like this. Um, what you're going to have to do for piano pieces, you may have to do layers, um, which basically how you do layers in finale is, um, if you have finale, you go... Um, Option Command 1 for Layer 1, Option Command 2, Layer 2, Option Command 3, Layer 3, Option Command 4 for Layer 4, and they have different colors of the layers, so you can put different parts in. Um, that's if you're doing Finale. If you're doing Muse Score, which I recommend for the lower level comp courses um, that I teach, there is a button to the right um, over by the play controls and you actually um, switch the layer by doing that. Um, for instance, in this one, if you go to layers, which would be up here somewhere, right here, these numbers, you can click that, or you could say, You can go carrot one two three four, but just so you know, just so you know, there are voice one, voice two, voice three, voice four up here on the far right in Muse Score. So now that we have those, now that we have that squared away, what we'll do is we're going to go back to the finale. Um, answer sheet for the choir piece. If you did a piano piece, it's going to look different than this, but this is the harmonic idea. Every piece that people create is going to be different. I'm not going to create it based on, oh, you don't have you don't have a piano piece or a choir piece. That'll be in a different comp course that I do that's more advanced. This is just for you to get the basics um, of all the things that uh, composition starts off with. So I'm going to play back uh, this piece and you will see in just six to eight measures or six to ten measures at least there is a wide variety of harmonic homophony and polyphony going on in here. So you'll see the difference here. So let's go playback controls. Okay, let's go back. I'm off any here. Now polyphony. Okay, so that's basically the piece um, that we have. So that is basically the piece in a nutshell. Um, you can hear in the first four measures there's a lot of homophony followed by the next... Five, this is about measure five. It breaks off into this polyphony of different sounds coming together for harmony, different lines converging together, that's what the polyphony is, there's a lot of stuff going on there. Then it goes back to a homophonic sort of texture almost toward the end to land on the C chord. So that's kind of what we are going after is the difference in textures. Okay, 
Um, if you guys have any questions, please feel free to consult the Q&A. Otherwise, I will see you in the next uh, segment. Hello, all. I wanted to give you this current courses for sale. Um, in addition to liking, commenting, and subscribing, please feel free to see the current courses for sale, which include Write Your First Piece of Music in 14 Steps, the original, um, and the, this is the link right here that you can go to with the coupon code Write Music. I've got several coupons for the courses right now. This is about $9.99, I believe. And then you've got Write Your First Piece of Music in 14 Steps, the Finale Edition course with the coupon code Finale that was just created today. Here's the link. And we have two links for the Music Composition 100, a composition premiere or primer. Get this at the following links, and here they are. The coupon codes are MUSIC100, now through the 29th. Um, and the next coupon code, MUSICU, all caps, both of these. Um, all of the MUSIC100 is now through June 29th. That coupon code is there. After that, Music U is the coupon code after the 29th of June. Also, the coupon code Write Music for the Write Your First Piece of Music in 14 Steps is also expiring on the uh, 29th of this month. So be sure to hit that. Be sure to check out all of these courses, all three of them, and see if they will be a benefit to you and please leave a like comment subscribe on this video again and also if you have any questions inside any of the courses please feel free to consult the Q&A that's always available in that case I will see you in the next video check out the courses